sweeties welcome back to my channel my name is ashley and you are watching mrs shorty here i do fashion beauty and also small business videos here on my channel today actually i need to exfoliate and i've never did this but it's a facial razor bought this at walgreens and guess who is going to come in here and show me how to use it and also do it for me is the one and only morning martinez my husband up, yeah. andrew he oh, come, comes in right here so today we have a lot of things to do like i need to do another video here so this is just going to be a video filming day and he decided he wanted to <laughs> shave my face <laughs> so that's what we're gonna be doing he's gonna go ahead and shave my face teach me how to use the razor i was trying to ask how a 45 degree what a 45 degree angle looks like oh looks God. like he knows what he's doing <laughs> um i mean he does have peach fuzz <laughs> or well he usually has a goatee <laughs> but he can't grow a beard so hopefully he knows how to use the razor <laughs> so my goodness uh, but yeah he's gonna he's he's gonna snatch this face <laughs> so where do you want what you want me like where exactly so i have peach fuzz around here here so i have peach yeah. fuzz around here and don't i have this pimple guy so make sure you you don't snatch him up <laughs> i'll leave a little bit just in case <laughs> <laughs> don't make him bleed if you know what i mean um i do they say to go like because i i am hairy everywhere mm -hmm. i have hair everywhere so when i usually go to the um person who used to do my eyebrows they used to wax all of my face because I'm just so hairy everywhere. But since pandemic and you know being that's a little bit of bouginess to do. So, yeah, so I don't we didn't have the funds to do it, so I haven't done it in a minute. But we have the funds, it's just they're closed. <laughs> yeah. Um but we'll see. We'll see what the straight razor okay. can do for my face. So, oh, um, and I'm going to test it out because I'm going to be putting foundation and just a natural look today to see So you want to do well. half of your face then? So then you can tell from left, right to left or left to right? No, I just want you to do the whole thing. <laughs> We're just going to see how it how it goes. Okay, so you want me? To, where do you want me to start? Anywhere you want. See, I can see some peach fuzz here. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'll just start there. And I'm not a professional, so don't, don't, don't try <laughs> this at home. <laughs> yeah. Unless you really know how to do this. Alright, so let's do this. I'm just gonna close my eyes. I'm just doing a light pressure. Just enough. This feels weird. What does it feel like? Feels like they're scraping the top surface of my face. I'm trying not to. Uh, I'm trying not to get in the camera. Oh, I could see my big ass pores now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Still some here. Can you take off some of my freaking Elvis Presley? <laughs> How far do you want to go? Here? Yeah, like, let's just shave that off. That might be a little bit harder. Oh, come on, man. I seen this girl do hers. And she had thicker... There we go. Snatched. <laughs> Ew. You want me to keep going on that side? Yep, just even it out. Make sure you get my chin too.
Well, maybe do you want to get like some aftershave or something or some lotion? Uh, I'll spritz my face. Is that okay? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's fine. Get some hydration back in there because I could hear the dryness <laughs> just like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like scared. Yeah. Wow, did you hear that guy's <laughs> water cut my throat? So, like everybody has peach was, I'm guessing, but I wasn't diagnosed with PCOS. I still want to eat as if I have PCOS because um, of all this hair going on. Um, but the doctors didn't diagnose me with PCOS. Um, there's no hormones in that would cause PCOS for me so I'm just so confused um, leave it in the comments down below if you are on the hairier side and don't have PCOS I don't feel alone but yeah mm -hmm. that's something that that was noticeable for me so feel, feel that side to see if it's a little bit smoother compared to the other side it's definitely a little bit smoother yeah, this one feels rough, and this one feels smooth. Yeah. All right, because it also, I guess, it says it also exfoliates. Yeah, because it's, pro it's probably taking some of the dead skin off your face. The first layer. Yeah. Okay. Whatever, whatever you know, like your, I don't know if you girls use like a, a brush to. Exf I know that the ones that they scrub their face with a little brush. So whatever that doesn't take off, this, this probably does. Got it. So, I don't know, I'm just a man. <laughs> He's just a man. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, I mean, it did feel better that you were holding my face. Okay. Because the other way, it seemed like you were going willy nilly. Yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll touch it up a little bit. You gonna line me up? Yeah, I'll line you up on the top of your forehead. Looks pretty good. Yeah. All we have to figure out is when I put my makeup on. I won't touch your eyebrows, don't worry. Oh, oh, are you getting close to my eyebrow, bro? No, I'm just getting all this, like, all this stuff right here. Oh. You see it? Like, actually lined up. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay, guys. So, unfortunately, I could not do the rest of the video that day, but I am two days in since my husband... Um, razored my face and I still think it looks pretty good I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and do my face here um, 
and yeah so we did if you guys haven't noticed we did switch up the area so this is our filming um you know living room and office my office is back there if you could see and we re did reconfigured everything i like how it looks i have my purses up there there's still going to be more here on this side um but yeah like i'm super excited for this i have not i mean i've shaved my face before but i've done it with like a regular leg razor and this time this is the actual way of doing it i've seen a lot of youtubers use it and i just wanted to see how it is um it was a really good experience so what i did was i put on this and we are going to be going into some treatments so this is my tula skincare i do have acne right here that's popping up i did start a new vitamin regimen so it's um helping to clear out any bad junk from my system so this is what i've been using so far for the spots and it's been working pretty good it dries it out um but i think i need to use a little bit more moisturizer because it does dry the skin a little bit so did this i'm gonna go in with my vitamin a retinol serum this is from formula 10.0.6 was I am a big fan of that brand from Ulta I got it from Ulta and I am a super big fan of it I used to wash with the cleanser which I really used to like um so I, I don't know if I want to get back into that brand because I did like it in the past um but yeah so this is what my face um, looks this like. This one, when I'm not going out or anything, I use the e.l.f. one, but I may be going out, so, um, like, outside and doing some pictures and all that, so I'm going to go ahead with the SPF. So, if you guys haven't been following me, a little update is that my mom is actually still in the hospital so if you want to give your support i actually created a new well i didn't create it but um i got the file from auntie tay um as you guys know i'm a i support her and pay for her um digital file. I have a reseller logo and reseller permit um, because I do purchase her $25 business course. And um, she had a really cute prayer one that I liked. And so if you want to, you could shop MrsShorty.com. I'll have the link down below. Um, basically, it is on a black t-shirt and a white t-shirt. And I do have two different color schemes. So they're good for... Um, you know, staying in faith and also it has hearts to incorporate that Valentine's -y look. Um, so if you want to support us and support the channel and my mom, um, go ahead and, you know, purchase some shirts. Um, there's some items that are also brand, brand new. And um, let me know what you think in the comments down below. I would love to know what your thoughts and all that stuff is I'm going to go in with glass liquid skin, which is an illuminating skin primer. I've been liking this one, but I've also been really loving the radial one. Um, I just want to use this, this one up. This is one. This is from Revolution. So we ended up trying. So we're doing everything we can. Um, she's, she just got out of surgery. Um, you guys know, if you didn't know, 
go ahead and check out my COVID, our COVID story, and I get into a little bit emotional um, because it is emotional. Like my mom is literally fighting for her life right now, and it's it's unfortunate. I've done everything. We've done everything by the book, and it still was not enough. And um, the upside of it is that we can only make sure that she is getting the proper care and making sure that she, you know, recovers in a more healthy way. Um, but until then, we have to just wait it out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and I've been using the Flawless Satin Foundation in the color Sand. It's the only thing that really matches me right now. Because the other foundations that I have that are on um, higher end, like my, ta my Tarte and my, um, which one's that one? Tarte and my other foundation is just too dark for me. So this one's been matching me pretty good. So far, the application of my foundation is really, I gotta get down here, um, is really smooth. I kind of like it now that my face has been, um, has been shaved down. So I'm, I'm thinking that I'm going to have to shave my face a lot now because it, it make, it does make it really smooth. There's just a little bit of a luminosity to my skin, um, from the glass liquid skin, which is fine. Um, not too mad about that. I've been a little bit on the drier side these days, so it actually works out. And this is a medium coverage satin finish. So this is also a satin finish with the glass liquid skin. Um, so that's a good combo right there. Not mad at it. I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows off camera. So this is the finished look. Nothing too crazy, but um, I am definitely going to give my husband shaves my face a two thumbs up. I really liked it. Comment down below if you would let your husband shave your face or if you actually used a razor like the one that we've used in the comments down below. And if you recommend any other type of razors that I haven't tried. This one was just the Walgreens brand that we found at Walgreens. So I'm pretty sure there's other brands that um, I can use or try out. Leave that all in the description box or I mean in the comments down below and I'll check them out. And yeah, so hopefully you guys are doing well. Please pray for my mom if you want to support our family here. Go ahead and shop www.mrshorty.com and I'll see you in my next video. Like always, stay super sweet. Bye. Life in a world that keeps changing. Think that it's progress you're making. Copy and paste pretty faces all the time.